Welcome to the fourth episode of This Happened Here. In this series, I will be bringing you true stories, the good and the bad, of what happened here in the US and anywhere else in the world I find interesting stories to share with you. Today I will be bringing you the story of Cumberland Falls, located in southern Kentucky. This falls, known to some as Little Niagara, the Niagara of the South, or the Great Falls, is the only site in the Western Hemisphere where a moonbow is visible when there is a full moon and a cloudless sky. But there have been many tragedies at this fall and posted signs warning of its danger. While researching and visiting this fall, this story came to me as if it was being told by the spirit of a Shawnee. Therefore, I will share it just as how I got it. Now, if you enjoy any part of this episode or have watched and like any of my past episodes, please give it a like, share and subscribe so you don't miss any of the future ones. I'll be posting a video weekly. I am your host, LT Bartek. Many moons ago, I walked this place as a Shawnee man, but I walk it as a man no more. Only my spirit still walks this land. For 10,000 years, my tribe has inhabited this land. We would come here to hunt and camp when the sun blazed hottest in the sky, and we would leave when the leaves age and dies falling off the trees. We would go then back to our home in the north, but my family comes here no more, only I remain. We would find shelter in the face of the rocks and hunt and eat what we kill, living off the fruits of the land, getting drunk on the berries and feasting on nuts, but I feast no more. I see the faces of the white man and many different colored people. I have seen the deaths of seventy. They come here to look upon the Shawnee River. They stay till night to see the moon bow. They call it now Cumberland Falls, but I know them not. My family is long gone, but my spirit lives here still. I linger here at the moon bow falls. It is sacred to me and my people. I am attached here. Maybe because I am known to my people as the moon walker. My tribe has long since from this place. They are all gone to be with my ancestors. 
Yet I linger here. I long to be with them, but I am destined to walk this land for eternity. My only joy is I watch over this fall. It calls and sings to me. I find peace here. Then at nights when the moon is high and full in the cloudless sky, I walk on the beam as it arches its white light from base to the stream, and I bask in its vastness and beautiful colors. Only then am I reminded of the beauty that is she. I am meant to be here, and here I will be. But I know these people no more. They are not my people. I am not of them. Like the birds that fly, so do I. My spirit flies here, and here I will stay, for I am the moonwalker. Okay, so if you're still here, Thanks for making it this far, and I hope you enjoyed it. If so, please do the green corn dance on that thumbs up icon, share this video, and click the bell so that you can stay in the loop for the rest of this series. Remember, I will upload an episode once every week. So stay tuned, and I look forward to having you on the next one. Take care, and goodbye.